Hello everybody. A very very sad news. What you and I know about Shashank Singh Rajput. A very young, energetic, intellectual person, a rising young man in the Bollywood fraternity. And he died by committing suicide because of depression. Now that's the truth that he died because of depression. But what led him to depression? I want to talk to you today. I want to urge each and every one of you today that if you have even a little bit of dignity in you you should boycott and ban bollywood completely shushan singh rajput died 6 month ago mentally bollywood killed him by stress these bollywood mafias who ruin your family with their unclean lifestyle who influence every young generation with their wicked lifestyle and that's what people worship today rajput was from shushan singh rajput was from a small village a poor man who worked hard and made his way up achieved great success in education and then gave up education and joined film to become an actor and as he was growing to be successful these fellows in bollywood all these mafias they did not want him to rise all these top 6 producers and directors and stars that you think and worship and bow down to them and run for their photo and and autographs and and watch their movies they are the ones who rejected and made Sushant Singh Rajput as an outsider they mentally killed him they outcast him because he was an outsider he was not a son of a famous film star or a bollywood actor or sons or director son or some politician son this is what bollywood does you know what bollywood is doing it not only killed sushant singh rajput mentally but it is killing you every day in your home right in your living room it's killing your family it's killing your culture it's killing your young people i am not someone who watches movie but i watched one movie just last year and that was of sushant singh rajput when i was flying on the aeroplane i watched the movie of dhoni because it was related to cricket and it was amazing it was very influencing and he made a great impact on many young people's life with that movie on playing cricket for india and exactly one year later today we hear that he died from what i know about sushant singh rajput he was very humble he was hard working but he was rejected he felt himself lonely do you know that he bought a piece of land in moon yes sushant singh rajput he bought a land in moon and he bought a telescope to see that moon every day sushant singh rajput had lots of money bought fancy cars and bikes lots of money bought a piece of land in the moon he had several million followers and yet he was lonely and that is what this world is going to give each and every one of you 
I know one thing, dear friends. I know one truth. There is somebody that loves you, even if the whole world hates you. You need to find that truth. You need to find that person who loves you. In fact, he gave himself for you. Now, I am a believer and follower of the Lord Jesus Christ. And the Bible tells that Jesus Christ is one true God. He became man and he died on the cross of Calvary by shedding his precious blood. To live in your heart, to give you forgiveness, to make you feel and know that truly that he is always with you. To give you hope, dear friends, that you no longer feel lonely about. I want you to consider Jesus Christ. He is one person who will never make you feel unloved, alone, lonely, ever. He promises to be with you always. I'm saddened by what happened with Sushant Singh Rajput. But that is what will happen to everybody who follows and worship these Bollywood stars and Hollywood stars. They're hypocrites. They're hypocrites. Don't worship them. Don't make them your heroes. Reject them. Ban those Bollywood stars and ban them. Boycott their movies. They're, they're ruining your family. They're ruining your life. They're not setting a good example. They're not role models to you and to me. I thank God for Jesus in my life. I believe what the Bible says. And I thank God that He is always with me. The Lord Jesus has given me hope, joy, and eternal peace. I believe that Jesus Christ is God. And He became man. And He gave Himself. He died on the cross by shedding His blood. He was buried and rose again on the third day. He lives in me and He wants to live in you. Don't commit suicide because you're alone. Go to Jesus today and you will never be alone. The world will reject you, hate you and make you feel lonely. But Jesus will only love you, accept you and will be with you always. Thank you dear friends.